The first moment that I had the honor to wear my Greek uniform was probably the happiest day of my life. I feel super blessed to be able to have the responsibility and the honor to wear it. Of course, somebody could be Greek without being Greek. I was born and raised in a city called Harrisburg in the state of Pennsylvania, in the United States of America. Being Greek is something that comes from inside of you. The love for the culture, the tradition, the language, the church. I was blessed to be a part of that as a young child. If it wasn't for my parents, I probably wouldn't be the Greek I am today. I thank them very much for everything they've done and the heritage they kept alive. Growing up, my first language was Greek. And going to school, it was hard picking up the difference between the languages. As a young child, I remember telling my father that I always wanted to join the Greek military. And we would come here as young kids and we'd come to the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. I uh, would see my grandfather's picture as a royal guard, as a presidential guard. I made the decision at 28 to come and serve my country with pride and respect and honor. Unfortunately, I never got the chance to meet my grandfather, nor did my father. My father's father passed away when he was two months old, so this is a good way to show a little bit of honor. As an American citizen, the Greek military was not a mandatory service for me. It was definitely a very long process. It took me three flights, but uh, I wouldn't change it. As an Evzon, we practice and we train on standing still. Um, we can start up to 20 minutes and reach up to three hours. Some of our duties are we stand guard at the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier. We stand guard at the Presidential Mansion. We also stand guard in front of our Army base. We do the raising and lowering of the Greek flag at the Acropolis. We practice for Sunday parades. And we also welcome foreign leaders that come from all over the world. My future dream as a Greek American is to spend half of my time in Greece and half of my time in America. You can most definitely be fully Greek and fully American all at the same time. It's definitely the way you've been raised. I'm a very perifanic and on your own too. But I'm sure of it's a very difficult time. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get the same thing. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to get the the values that I've learned are family before everything, especially for my brothers I serve with because we all go through the same pain and the same happiness. Don't take anything for granted. Live your life day by day. Every time I come back to Greece, I'll definitely visit the Tomb of the Unknown Soldier and wish I could do another duty.